Hello YouTube, it's Mr. Twinker, but this isn't a Minecraft video. This is a video for all of you who want to make like Minecraft server and like this doesn't include port forwarding. You'll need to go to another place to do port forwarding, but this will show you the basics. First off, you'll probably need a program called cra oh, me and my bad typing craft bucket and it'll be on this website called bucket and all you gotta do is get the latest one you can get it over here it'll say fetching feeds and it'll give you a recommended build all you gotta do is download that and once you've downloaded that put it into a um a folder and all you gotta do is make a file the site like go new text document and call it run or start or something like that and at the end as bat as in batch if you change a file name extension this file may become unusable of course we want that right click and go edit and what you want to type in is you have to go to the minecraft website like so and just log in oh you don't actually need to log in just go download and then down here you want to copy this bit not the no GUI you don't want that bit just copy all this copy and then just paste it into this file now that is your running thing well I don't need that so I'm gonna delete it and you should get this just double click on that and it'll make all these files here and this will be called world unless you change it in the server.properties file okay that's all for, well once you get the server.properties file you can change the name hell world spoil monsters yada 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 but you want to keep this blank. Server IP is blank. And then save and close. Okay. And now you want to go to just make a new tab and type in dyndns.com. And it'll take you to this site. and it'll show up here now just create an account I already have one so I will sign in there's the create an account sign just do what I ask you okay and then go services and pricing and it'll bring you to here oh I mean um here, uh, just click on here, DYN DNS free, and then go down and get DDNS update clients. Now go and get for your platform, mine is Windows, just click on that and download it. I mean, um, don't click on that, you can click on here, that's what you want and you'll get a little file after you've successfully downloaded it and it'll ask for your username and password just put that in and I've already got a thing there but don't need that just click OK now what you want to do is go services and pricing DYN DNS free 
and create free host name. Okay. Now just go host name and call you want what you want. I'll call mine test server. And then it'll go dot and then you you probably want dyndns.org. Just click that. And all you gotta do is click this little link here and it'll pop that up there. And that is it. And then you go add to cart. Oh ah. And if it do, if you uh if this is already taken, then you'll have to do something else. I'll call mine Mr. Twinket. Add to cart. Okay. Finish free checkout to activate. Just go proceed to checkout. Doesn't ask you for anything. <clears throat> and go activate services. After a while, okay. And it'll have your thing right here. That's all you need. Just minimize that and go back to this. And it should load up. Just check that box and go apply. Okay, once that's done, simple, easy, you now have a working server. Let's, uh, oh, and it'll come up here. DYNDNS returned good. It's now synchronized. Now you can go start.bat or your run.bat or whatever. And obviously mine's loading all the plugins. And now yeah, I've got a texture pack. And then you can log in with localhost, but everyone else logs in using this. Okay? Just go connect, and of course, you'll log in. Plain as usual, without, oh, laggy, without any whatsoever Hamachi or other programming, or other connecting tool. And that is all for now, and I will see you.